I look very bad. That's a no. <laughs> but I just needed to quick film this intro and everything because I wanted to upload but I don't want to get all done up and everything but the point of this video is not the way I look um, but the point of this video is the DIY video and I'm going to be showing you guys a DIY soap jelly lush thing I don't know how to explain it but it's like a soap that it's like a jelly that is a soap um yeah I don't, I don't know but it's really simple and I hope you guys will like my DIY. I know I've been doing a lot of DIYs lately, but I really like doing them and I hope you guys like them. If not, then I'm really sorry. Just comment down below some video requests that you'd like to see down below in the description and that'd be great. So yeah, let's get on with the video. So the things that you need are boiling water, soap and shampoo or shampoo. I use shampoo and this is optional food coloring. I didn't use it because my shampoo, like it was already colored enough. So you don't have to use that and also lastly gelatin. So the first thing you're going to do is take your gelatin and just put it into your bowl. And then you're going to pour one cup of your boiling hot water into your gelatin and then put half of a teaspoon of salt and just mix that all in. And then you're going to put three fourths of a cup of soap or shampoo and just pour that in and just mix it all in yeah mix it all in and I chose to put it in something that I could pour into the molds easier because I'm very messy so I just poured it into all of my molds <laughs> So I had some bubbles from mixing it because it was just like shampoo and it gets soapy so all you have to do is just scoop it out. You could do it when it's still in the cup or whatever that you had before but I forgot to do that. And then you're just going to cool it for 4 hours or overnight and I did it for 4 hours and you're just going to take it out of the mold and once you do that you're all done. So hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, please make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and also don't forget to click that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!